What up, IDS Mob? Welcome to the Introvert Dating Success Membership Academy launch. That's right. You put the little ticker on here. Yes, today is finally the day where the Introvert Dating Success Membership Academy is launching. For those of you that have not heard me talk about it for the last two months on my show, this is actually the website right here where you can go to learn all about things related to dating, related to being an introvert, and to helping you figure out once and for all the various things you need to know in order to properly date, meet, greet, attract, and land the woman of your dreams while still getting your precious alone time. So we're launching that today. So today I'm gonna just be talking a little bit about the academy itself. I'll also be willing to answer any programs, I mean, uh, uh, answer any questions along the way. Let me put the, the thing here in the chat right here so you can go to the website. But yeah, so you can literally go to the, I have not changed the website for this, like the name of it. You can literally go to introvertdatingsuccess.com. When you get there on the front page, you'll see all the stuff, which I'll get into a little bit later. But I want to kind of talk about what the, why I created the Academy in the first place. So I have been now giving dating advice since 2004, back when I had a really bad, not even a breakup. I had, I had a chance to get with a friend of mine. I messed it up. I got really depressed about it. And I realized at that point that at that point I had been studying up on how to be a better dater. Cause I was just really not that great at it. And despite my knowledge, I realized that because I was very new at learning this stuff, I hadn't really developed the things I was learning into a habit, but I also realized I needed to reflect on what it was I was doing wrong. So that way at least I could have it down somewhere so I could know, okay, don't do these things that you now know you shouldn't do. So I wrote the book, uh, No Girls For You, The Ultimate Guide to Losing the Woman of Your Dreams. And I actually started selling a few copies of it and people really gelled with it. And it was a whole book that was basically telling people, hey, if you wanna lose women, do all these things over here. Compliment them all the time. Don't talk about sex. Uh, don't know how to dress. Like all these things that guys were typically doing to try to get women and explaining to them through in a funny way, mind you, how that ends up chasing them off. So then as I got better at dating though, it went from me giving advice on what not to do to being able to give advice on what actually was working for me as well as other people that I started to coach. And so just over these years, so since 2004 to now, it's been like 18 years I've been giving dating advice. I've written eBooks and I've launched various programs and I've done uh, two podcasts. I had the first one, Stop Losing Women, which was very, very popular, as well as the one I have now called Introvert Dating Success. And so the more I've been recording stuff and putting together programs, I realized I had just amassed a huge lot of uh, audios and videos and PDFs and eBooks and audiobooks of things. And there had been various points where I was launching these things separately, like uh, Smart Digital Dating, I launched as a separate course. The, uh, the Top Secret Dating Blueprint was a separate course. The eBooks are courses, separate entities. And I was like, I honestly, I just got tired of doing launches. like. <laughs> As much as I know, there's there's like the profit involved. Like, oh, you launch these things for like a huge amount of money. The reality is like having to build up to each of these launches gets really exhausting. And I'm 40 now and I don't want to do all that much work. But I, and I also really, really think that in terms of like dating advice stuff, like I do believe that there's value in it. And I do believe that honestly, I should charge something for it. But I also believe that like it shouldn't be so like highly expensive that somebody can't get it. And also for guys that are just that are trying to learn dating stuff. I don't feel the need to have to charge them an exorbitant amount of money from all these programs to do it. So I figured, you know what, rather than continuing to launch all these various programs, why not just have one site that's a membership site where people can go to get all the stuff, like all the programs, all the audios, all the uh, eBooks, everything that you've created and will continue to create can just go into this one website where people can pay a nominal monthly fee and have access to it. And then they can cancel whenever they don't need it anymore. Because you know, in your dating journey, I honestly believe there's gonna be points where you're gonna need a lot more instruction. And at the point where you don't need it as much anymore, you shouldn't have to continue to be latched on to something that you got. So that's why I had this site set up as a membership site because it's a, you can do either a monthly or a yearly membership fee, or you can do a lifetime access if you want to, but I set it up to have that monthly and yearly option because at the point where you, let's say you join for like a month to month, and after month three, you're like, hey, you know what? I figured out how to do this whole dating thing thanks to all of Harry's advice. 
then you can just stop paying and then that's the end of it. And then if you decide you want to come back, you can come back anytime you want. But I figured that would be the best way for me because I, I me creating all these things and trying to do these various launches, it just, it's exhausting. But having it one, one place benefits me because I can just have it all in one place and it benefits you because this is going to be like, this is why I call it the Netflix of dating advice because as I continue to make stuff, like when I put out, uh, more podcasts, when I put out specialty videos, when I do uh, lives where I answer questions, uh, Q&As and stuff like that, you can, you can get all that stuff in one situation. On top of that, you'll also get discounts on one-on-one uh, -on -one coaching. So what I charge for like uh, a phone session, like you'll get, you can pay like half of that when you're a member of this, of this program. Okay. So that's basically why I created the membership uh, Academy itself. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to actually play you the video that really goes into detail about what the site's all about. And uh, yeah, this is also on the website as well, but let me just put this up on the screen here real quick. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and play this for you guys. And then I will be back. Here we go. Dating. Am I right? I mean, it's supposed to be this fun, magical thing where you can meet a woman Show her what a great guy you are, sweep her off her feet, and boom, you end up in a relationship where you live happily ever after. But in reality, dating can have you feeling more like this. Ah, somebody help me. My dating life is burning to the ground. Where's the water hose? Where's the water hose? <laughs> That's because with dating, there are just so many things you have to know about to make it work, right? You have to know about women and what they like and what they don't like. And you have to know what to say, how to say it, when to say it, when to text, what to do if she pulls away, what it means when she pulls away. You have to figure out if and when they're testing you and what makes them feel attracted to you. Oh, oh, and then you have to know when to kiss her and if hooking up with her means that she's really ready for a relationship or not. All of this while looking for red flags, learning about her dating history, is she trustworthy? Oh, and most importantly, is she going to be bothered that you're an introvert and want your alone time? Ah! Well, fear not, because you're about to learn about a membership site that answers almost any dating question you've ever had. That's right, no more fear, no more anxiety. Just a library chock full of videos, audios, and PDFs to help you navigate this whole dating thing. I call it the Introvert Dating Success Membership Academy. This academy is what I like to call the Netflix of dating advice. See, over the last 18 years between my various podcasts, online programs, and eBooks, I've put together a massive catalog containing literally hundreds of hours worth of dating advice, covering a wide range of subjects. And now I put all this media into a membership site where you'll be able to gain clarity on any area of dating you may be struggling with. For example, can't figure out how to text women? We've got an ebook and several audios for that. Wondering how to be less anxious and more self-confident around women? We've got videos for that as well. Or you're getting thrown off when a woman says one thing but means another thing? Well, we've got a bunch of lessons on how to not only understand her better, but make her feel seen and heard at the same time. The Introvert Dating Success Academy is something that I wish I would have had guide me in my early dating years. But hey, just because it took me this long to understand this whole dating thing, it doesn't mean it should take you that long. And with my help, and the help of some other people, which I'll, I'll get to in a minute, you'll be able to take your dating life and the women you get to date to the next level. Now, I don't wanna take up too much of your time here, but I wanna tell you about some of the awesome channels that we already have available in the members area. Oh, and by the way, much like Netflix, this is an always evolving site, meaning that there will constantly be new content getting added to the website. But for now, I want you to check out what we already have in the membership site to offer. First up is my top secret dating blueprint. It's 12 video lessons that give you an extensive, definitive blueprint on how to meet, greet, attract, date, escalate, and eventually end up in a relationship with women in an easy, natural way. You'll dive deep into learning things like how to get a woman's number, what things to talk about on the phone that get her to say yes to a date what to do on the first date and second date to increase her feelings for you authentically. 
when to go for that first kiss and how to know for sure that she actually wants it. Plus, you'll learn the correct pacing for how often you should see her and contact her, what to be doing and not doing between dates to make her think about you. And of course, when and how to have the oh so important, what are we conversation that leads her to becoming your girlfriend. This is the tried and true method that will help you get into relationships with just about any sane woman. Anyone that's kind, loving, compassionate, and will put you in the driver's seat of the relationship and her heart. The next channel is Smart Digital Dating. Now this 12 part video series will help you better understand the dynamics of online and phone app dating and give you key strategies for choosing pictures that women find flattering, creating a bio that makes her more curious about you and want to reach out understanding how women typically experience dating apps so you can give her the best experience possible, communication strategies that make her look forward to every message you send her. And we lay out a blueprint for you to use to know when and how to ask for the date in a bold way that makes almost every woman want to say yes. Next, we have the seven part series called Stop Miscommunicating with Women. If you've ever struggled with wondering why a woman may appear standoffish when you first walk up to her, or frustrated when they try to test you, or, and this is a big one, uh, she says she wants one thing from you, but doesn't seem to like it when she gets it, yeah, then this is the series for you. By the time you've gone through all seven lessons, you'll have a better understanding of why women communicate the way that they do, and most importantly, you'll be able to connect with her so well that all she'll be thinking about is how lucky she is to have someone that knows her as well as you do. From there, we have the Interviews with Dating Experts channel. And man, oh man, this one is pure relationship advice gold. You see, over the years, I've had the pleasure of interviewing numerous experts in the dating field, as well as men who are husbands, women who are looking for love on dating apps and out in public, and authors who have written books on dating dynamics. And now you'll be able to hear from all these people on this one channel. And look, the insights that they give on a variety of topics will forever change your life. For example, we have an interview with none other than Marnie the Wing Girl about how to approach women and the way that she talks about how women are experiencing you when you come up to them. Well, it's definitely something you'll want to hear. We also have a couple of interviews where you'll learn how to handle small talk, insights, on what it's really like to be a married man and how to become the right man for marriage. There's also an interview in there on how your health actually affects how you show up in relationships and so much more. Next up are two of my audiobooks, 10 Steps to Winning Back Your Ex, which gives you a 10 step strategy for rekindling romance with a former partner, regardless of who started the breakup. And No Girls For You, The Ultimate Guide to Losing the Woman of Your Dreams. Now, this is the book that started this entire giving advice dating journey for me, and it's full of hilarious insights and dating stories from my real life, mind you, that will help illustrate why all the things you think should work to attract women, like complimenting them, buying them gifts, not talking about SEX, uh, actually causes you to lose them. And yes, these books are also on here in PDF form as well, in case you'd rather read through them. You'll also get a third ebook, Texting Like a Boss, which is great if you're a guy that struggled with getting women to text you back or having text conversations die out after a few days. You will learn the 21 texting commandments that will have women anticipating your next message and dying to talk to you. Then of course, we have the two podcast channels. Now the first one is the Stop Losing Women podcast channel. And this is the first podcast show that I did from 2013 to 2018. And it's only available on this membership website. Over the span of 435 episodes, this show helps men just like you learn valuable lessons about what women really want. And now they are here for you to expand your knowledge about how dating actually works instead of how you wish it would work. And now the second podcast channel is, well, what else? The, the Introvert Dating Success Podcast. So if you're an introvert that struggled to know how to show up as your authentic self around women, and you need guidance on things like how to get your alone time, or what to do when you're feeling overwhelmed, what kind of conversations to have with women to make sure you both feel connected, and literally a plethora of other topics, then this channel is for you. 
Now, as of this recording, there are over 400 episodes of that show as well, and more will continue to be added in the near future. Speaking of which, as I said earlier, not only will you get all the channels I just mentioned, but we will be constantly adding members-only content to the Academy, including special video tutorials like we already have there, members-only webinars, and monthly Q&As, where you'll be able to ask me anything and get your questions answered on the spot. In fact, we have a whole channel that's just for you to be able to leave me questions to answer. And with your membership, you'll be able to have your dating questions answered much quicker than the ones I get from non-members, usually within 24 to 48 hours or less. So if you have a situation come up with a woman and you're not you know, quite sure how to handle it, or you just have questions about women and dating in general, well, no need to worry. You'll get your answers from me right away. Well. All of this sounds great. Where do I sign up? Well, that's easy. Simply scroll down below, check out the enrollment options, and choose the one that works best for you. From there, you'll be taken to a checkout page where you'll fill out some information, and boom, you'll gain instant access to the best dating advice membership site in the world, where you can get started changing your dating life today. If you have any questions about the Introvert Dating Success Membership Academy, you can reach out to me at harrywilmington at gmail.com. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you inside. Thank you. I had muted myself. So anyway, yeah. So like I was saying, uh, I'm, this is the web, the actual website itself. And so I kept saying it's the Netflix of dating advice. And so to that end, what I decided to do was to make the front page look like the Netflix page. That's why you see all the various like programs, just like they had their TV shows in the background here. But the point is, yeah, so they don't have a video on the front page, but this is the same video that I just showed you guys right here. And then you can see we scroll down. Uh, unlimited dating strategies for introverted men learn to attract women as your authentic self while still getting your alone time if in the event that for some reason you're not able to get the video audio you can click that thing right there also and get the full text of it so you see this is literally the entire script that you just heard on video which can give you a, a, a visual reminder of what I just said so bring that back up here and as you scroll down as you see we have the plans right here to search membership so we have three plans we have uh, monthly plan, which is 37 a month, uh, which gives you access to all the videos, audios, and PDFs. Uh, you also have access to twice a month live Q&As, and you get immediate email responses. So when, you, when you're part of the membership site, basically, if you have a question, we have a section where you can ask questions. Uh, I try to get to all questions within the span of 24 to 48 hours, and I also have the twice a month live where you can ask, ask questions, and I'll answer them on the live as well. So uh, we have, if the monthly is 37 per month. We have a yearly plan, which is three ninety seven per year. So you save a little bit of money versus the monthly plan in terms of like what it totals out to. Uh, so you get all the stuff I just mentioned. And also you will get two free one hour coaching calls included with the yearly plan. So you can, we can schedule those whenever you want to. And then you guys also get discounts on uh, just the coaching. So you get half off of what my normal coaching rate is uh, for the phone plan. But you get two out the gate when you join the yearly plan. And then I have the lifetime access plan with one-time payment. This is normally going to be uh, $19.97, but for the, for the launch week only, which is from now until next Tuesday, you can just get access, lifetime access to the membership site for $9.97. And you get all the stuff I just mentioned, except you get four free one-hour coaching calls per year. So from now until, I guess, either you die or whatever, you will be getting four calls from me per year that we can set up to talk about where your dating or relationship life is and how it's been going, all right? Also, you notice for these first two plans, for the monthly plan and for the yearly plan, uh, they include two-day free trials. So I did that because I want you guys to be able to actually, uh, like, 
test out and see if you like what I have to offer. Because, you know, I hate those things where it's like people will say, oh, just, just, just trust me. Just go in there and order, blah, blah, blah. Granted, you guys are coming from my podcast. So if you know my podcast, you probably see my podcast and my YouTube channel. You know my videos. So if you like that stuff, you're pretty much guaranteed to like what is in the membership site, which is why, which is why I offer the lifetime access. Because if you already know, you already know. But if you're not sure, what you can do is you can sign up for this today. And you, you know, you'll fill out your information and your, your credit card, stuff like that, but you won't actually get charged today. So you'll go there. You'll have two full days to go through the entire website. Everything's accessible. All the programs, all the videos, all the PDFs, all the MP3s, all that stuff's accessible. If after two days you're like, eh, it's not for me, you can cancel it. And then that, that's, that's the end of it. But if you like it, then you'll get starting, you'll, you'll start getting charged month to month. So that means that you won't, there, there's no like, um, there's no uh, money back guarantee because you already get the two day free trial to test out and see if you, the, the stuff that I have is going to help you. All right. So that's that you scroll down some more, just kind of gives you a little bit, again, this is all set up just like Netflix does their stuff, but it just kind of gives you brief details about what you're going to be getting and the results you're going to get when you join this membership Academy. There's so much stuff here, guys, you're going to have to be good at dating by the time you're done with this thing, because there's just so much stuff. We cover so many areas in the membership program we, between the, the, the blueprint program where you'll actually learn the ins and outs of how to go from dating somebody to actually like getting them to be your girlfriend, how to do online dating, how to speak the language. There's just so much stuff that regardless of how long you decide to stay as a, as a member, you're going to be learning stuff all the time and it's going to help you immensely with your dating life. All right. And then of course, down here, we have frequently asked questions. What is the Academy? How much does it cost? Where can you access it? How do you cancel it? Yada, yada, yada. And then there. So then once you, so what will happen is you'll click on one of these plans. You'll go, you'll get taken to a payment page. You'll fill out the information. And then as soon as you're done filling it out, you will get instant access. I think you got to create yourself like a name and a password, but you'll get instant access to it. And then this is what the course actually looks like right here. Let me see if it's showing on my screen. Yes. So right here we have what the inside of the course looks like. And basically like I said, it's literally like a list of just, you know, program after program after program. And let's say we'll click on this right here. This is a, uh, this is the first video in the top secret dating blueprint. So you click on that, for example, and you'll get taken to something like this and you'll see the first video pops up. You'll be able to play the video there. And just on the left side here, as you scroll down, you'll see, these are all the videos that are in the top secret dating blueprint. Scroll down here. Then we start off with the smart digital dating uh, channel where you'll have access and you can, you can watch this stuff in any order. There's no, like you have to go in, in, in the exact order that this is stuff is listed. You can jump from channel to channel, whatever you want to focus on. You can focus on, this is the smart digital dating one right here. We have here the stop miscommunicating with women, the seven part audio series. You can click on that and you'll see the, the audio. You just press play and it starts playing for you. And you have seven of these down here. We have the interviews with dating experts. Uh, all these have audio. Some of these have audio and video because I started doing video for some of these like a couple of years ago. But yeah, you'll see all, I think it's like 29 or 30 interviews at the moment. And I said, as I, as I interview more people, we're going to add more interviews to the website. So this is going to be an ever evolving membership site. Here we have the, uh, the, my eBooks and audio books is the 10 steps to winning back your ex. And then this one here is no girls for you. The ultimate guide to losing the girl of your dreams, texting like a boss in PDF right here. And then of course we have the podcast. So this is the stop losing women podcast. This is the podcast that I had first that I recorded that got very, very popular. People have been asking me for years, Hey, is there a place we can get the, the, the listen to the episodes of the stop losing women podcast? Well, now you can, there are, 435 episodes of the show contained within that. Again, that by itself, between that and the Introvert Dating Success podcast, that's already like over two or 300 hours worth of rock solid advice that's going to help you get to the next level. And as you'll be able to see, if I click here on the, so on the page, you'll see it says like, oh, episodes one through 50. But when you click on the actual uh, part of the website, you'll see each one of the shows is listed. So you can actually go through here and see what ones you, what titles you like and which ones you want to actually read up, listen up on to be able to get the advice that you need. That's both in the introvert dating success podcast, as well as in the stop losing women section. You see here, episode 156, bragging about your greatness without bragging. 
Um, we have an interview here. So the, some of the interviews are, are dragged from the podcast that I've done, but they're also in video form in, the, in, the, in their own section. And I'm actually going through these, through the various podcast shows and trying to mine out like if there's any specific like through lines that I did that could be their own little mini programs, it'll just be easier to find them when I put them as their own separate entity. But yeah, you get the idea. And then down here, we have the ask me your questions thing. So uh, I have to still put a video in there uh, that's going to basically be a, Hey, ask me questions guys. But in that comment section, you'll be able to leave questions. Uh, if some questions you want answered on one of the shows, or if you want the question answered right away, then we'll be able to do that as well for you. But yeah, as you can see, you get a lot out of this program. So again, this is like my life's work contained in like one full entity. And it's again, for all that you're being offered, it's a very affordable price. It's only $37 a month, three ninety-seven for the year. And you get a lot of great value out of that. All right. So hopefully you guys, you guys will be able to go to the website. You'll be able to check it out again. You can go there. Now you get two free days, the first two days to check it out and see if you like it. So you're not even losing any money by checking it out, but you're definitely gonna get a lot out of it. And hopefully you'll be able to get, you'll be a lot further in your journey than I was having to try to find all this stuff out by myself. You know what I'm saying? Uh, lastly, since I'm here, I actually wanted to answer somebody's question. So, uh, actually, I believe it's you're you're currently on the uh, <laughs> you're currently in the comments. But anyway, because uh, you had asked me a question, and this is just I'm going to give you guys an example of how I do these Q and A's. So these these bi monthly Q and A's, or, or sorry, every two weeks or so that we do these Q and A's. This is where you'll get to ask me questions, and I'll get to actually answer you live, like so you'll get the answer that you need. So this this person asked me a question on my YouTube channel though, and I want to answer it now. So it's, uh, he said, Hey coach, I keep getting ghosted with online dating. I, I don't have trouble getting lots of matches, but I have to say to be saying something wrong. As soon as I set up a date and time and I stop texting, uh, they lose interest and ghost. I've been on dates with only two girls in the last few months. I know I have to be messing up somewhere. Thanks in advance. So this is an example of like what we call like advanced technique, because there's a lot of stuff that I talk about on the YouTube show and I talk about in the podcast, but there's really some like nuanced things that if you're not, if you're not well versed in it, then it can kind of trip you up. So I always tend to ask questions when people ask me questions so I can get better clarification. So uh, I asked them, how long do you talk or text with them before asking them out? And when you ask them out, how do you normally do it? I.e. what's your full asking out sequence? And so in the, in the membership academy, I actually go through a whole sequence. For example, in the smart digital dating program, I talk about what the sequence is for asking a woman out and for setting up the date and then for when the date should happen. So that way you're going to have a better chance of a woman actually showing up when you set up the date. So anyway, he said, I usually chat with them about a day or two, and then I go straight to asking for the date. Now that's actually great because I do the same thing. Usually I'm usually able to get a date. Honestly, usually if I'm talking to a woman, like say I match up with her in the morning, usually by that night or the next day, we're on a date. Like I don't really waste a lot of time. At most, I'll talk to them for a couple of days, but then I'm trying to set up a date as soon as possible because I want to get them out in person where we can do tactile stuff. So that, that, that part's great. Uh, he says, I get a lot of yeses, <clears throat> but the dates are usually planned a few days to a week in advance. As soon as the date is planned, I stop texting and I usually get ghosted after that. Can it be because I don't continue the convo and my asking sequence goes like I'm free Mondays and Wednesdays. Let's go for a picnic, dinner, ice cream, etc. Uh, I get plenty of yeses, but they lose interest. Unfortunately, I've been on multiple dates already with, with two and had a great time. As long as I can get my foot in the door with these women, I know I can keep them around. The hard part is landing the date. Should I continue the convos a few days longer before actually meeting for the first time? Maybe a quick video chat before the first date. Uh, I typically, I, I rarely have done video chats before a date. And usually when I have like, usually the times that I've done that, they, it's usually results in me not going further with the date. And admittedly, if, if you're not interested in them on a video chat, you're probably not going to be that interested in them in person. But I find just something about being able to see somebody in person typically is more effective in terms of the attraction process than trying to do a video date and chat. I just, just, that's just been my experience. Other people have probably had a better experience doing video chat thing. I just have not been the one. I'm usually like, hey, let's set up a date. Let's go meet in person. And then I, the first time I see him in person is when I see him in person, not over video chat. But anyway, he asked. Uh, so then I asked him, 
why are you planning the date so far in advance? Cause he says he's setting up the dates for like a few days to like a week in advance. And he said, I'm busy with work. Uh, those are really my only days I have available. Although he didn't really say what days he has available, but uh, he says also because when I plan a date, uh, I already have another date planned before that ends up flaking. So I end up with no date. Okay. So anyway, so I want to answer this question. So let's go back to the thing about the setting up the dates. So here's the thing is that when you set up a date at that point, you got to figure like the woman's engine is now started. So at the point where you said, Hey, let's go on a date. Let's go out. She, her next gear is like, great. He asked me the date. Now the date's going to happen. And so if you ask her, say on a Wednesday for a date for next Wednesday, that engine over time can start to cool down. And to the point where that gives her a week, A, for her engine to cool down, but B, also for like, if you, you mean to go on a dating app, that gives her time in the week for other guys to hit her up and ask her on a date. So let's say you hit her up in, on a Wednesday and ask her for next Wednesday. Well, by Monday, she could have talked to a guy that had a better date idea or was just able to do it a lot faster. And now she's already been on, on a date with that guy. Maybe she's feeling him a little bit. And now she's like, that, that, that other guy I was talking to, he was cool, but like, I went on a date with this guy already and I'm already feeling the thing. So I don't want to ruin this thing by trying to go out with the one over here now. And so what I typically advise is this, is that you asking about on dates, very great. I'm glad you're doing it because a lot of guys don't make that step, but you need to be asking, either asking for the date closer to a time when you can do it a lot faster or figure out a way to have communication going while you're waiting for the date to happen. So for the first example, right? Let's say you're talking to a woman and you know that you're not free to see her until Tuesday and it's Wednesday, right? So you got to wait until that next Tuesday to come around to take her on a date, right? So I would err on the side of keeping your conversation to texting on the dating app. And I know I, I tell people all the time, texting kills attraction, but that's, that's usually after you've met the person in person. Prior to, especially on dating apps, your main motor operandi is going to be texting and communicating. But that doesn't mean you got to be on the app with them like 24-7 either. You can do like five or six texts a day and be good. But you text her from that Wednesday until that, say to that Saturday or Sunday and then say, Hey, why don't we go out? I'm free Monday or Wednesday. Now, if she says Monday, well, you're texting her this question on a Sunday. It's only one day. And psychologically she can wait a day to see you. Her having to wait seven days is going to be a little harder. Not that she can't do it, but it's going to be harder for her to not get an interference in that time. The other option is let's say you're talking to a girl on Wednesday and you can't go on a date with her until the next Wednesday, right? So you could do this. You could text her a little bit. And then on that, I don't typically try to ask for dates on Fridays and Saturdays, but if you're texting her on the, on the online dating apps, say you hit her up on like a Saturday afternoon saying, Hey, I'm going to take you out. I'm free next Wednesday or, or Monday, which again, is still a lot closer to when you can actually take her out. And she says, sure. So you set the date up for like Wednesday, but now it's Saturday. So that gives you Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, three days, right? And again, I talk about this in the program. You can play certain games with women on these dating apps that will keep them intrigued. I, for example, like to do the 20 questions game. I say, hey, so while we're waiting for our date to happen, how about a rousing game of 20 questions? Very simple. I'll ask you a question. You answer it. You ask me back a question and we get to learn a bit more about each other. And you ask her like three or four questions a day. By the time you get to Wednesday, you'll be done with the 20 questions. And then the next day is your date. So she's still being engaged with you. And it's again, still keeping her in the thing of like, oh, the date's coming, the date's coming, the date's coming. And so you're still interacting versus like saying, great, we got a date. And I set it up on Wednesday for next Wednesday. And I'm going to go dead for her for the next seven days. That can make a woman feel like either a, you're slowly not building interest or you just are just pushing her to the wayside like she's not that important. And you don't want a woman to, on a dating app to feel like you asked for this date and now all of a sudden you're brushing her off or you set up a date and now, and even if you are dating other women, she doesn't want to feel like she's at the bottom end of the list. So if you said, if you're on a win, if you're talking to her on a Wednesday, setting up a date for next Wednesday, and then you don't talk to her, she's going to feel like she's starting to get to the bottom of the list and you don't need that. All right. So hopefully that can help you out is that a, again, Try to set these dates closer to when you can go. I don't care if you met her on a Wednesday and you can't go until next Wednesday. Ask her out on Monday so it won't be so far apart. The closer you are to me, because I'll tell you, I ask women on dates 
and get same day dates. Cause I'm like, Hey, why are we fooling around? You got to eat. I got to eat. Let's go get some dinner. Let's go get some pizza and just chat it up while we got time. Like why, why, why are we messing around? And that takes, that takes me anywhere between like the same day to at the most I'll talk to him for like two days, but I don't spend like a, an exorbitant amount of time on dating apps, just talking and talking and talking because that's what 95% of other men on these dating apps are doing is just talking and talking and then saying, Hey, we should go on a date. And the woman's like, great. That's a great idea. And then the guy's like, awesome. So I'll hit you up next week to, to ask you where you want to go. Don't be that guy. Always have a plan. Know where you want to go and ask closer to when you can go. Cause you're the guy that's setting the agenda. So she's looking for you to set the time and set the agenda. And if you're setting an agenda, that's like a week out. Some women will stay around for that, but most are going to be like, I, I want to date like now. And you're I can, I, I can try to wait a week, but I'm not going to stop w going out with other people while I'm waiting for you. So hopefully guy that can help you out. But yeah, Anyway, so yeah, that's all I got for today, guys. So yeah, definitely go to introvertdatingsuccess.com and join the membership website. Like I said, for this week, we got the specialty rate uh, for the lifetime membership. So you can get it for either like, you know, for the 997 that it is now, or you can wait till after this week and get it for 1997. But either way, it's gonna, it's a great value regardless. And like I said, we're gonna constantly be adding things. I also take suggestions of things to add to the website. So if there's a topic or subject that you want me to cover or do like a little mini like course about, then I you have the the way to do that through the website as well. Just say, hey, Harry, I want to see a, a, you talk about this subject or can you do a course on this thing in the website and I'll, and I'll put something together and put it in there. So hopefully, guys, you'll check it out. And if you have any questions about the website, you can always write to me at harrywilmington at gmail.com. Uh, yeah, that's all I got, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching this episode. And please, 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 I cannot stress enough, go to the website, check it out. You get the first two days free. If you like it, keep on. If you don't like it, then it, no, you don't get charged anything. But I think you're going to get a lot of value out of the Introvert Dating Success Membership Academy. I'm Harry Wilmington, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. I'm out. Peace. Thanks for listening to the Introvert Dating Success Podcast. Visit us at introvertdatingsuccess.com for more great tips on attracting women using your natural introvert charm. Oh, yeah.